What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Jake Shavink here and Packers fans. It has been a while since we've done a film room, but we're going to do one this week here on the channel on a guy who's, I think, acclimated really well in a Packers defense that's kind of been up and down so far under Joe Barry. But this player has done very well. He's not the defensive MVP so far. I would say Kenny Clark or Jair Alexander has been that to this point. But he's shown market improvement throughout these first four weeks of the season. And I want to talk about him today. And that is linebacker Devondre Campbell, who came over. He was drafted by the Falcons. Ended up not sticking around there. Green Bay picks him up this past offseason. And really, he joined a linebacking corps that after Chris Barnes... You know, we weren't sure what to expect. There was talk about Kamal Martin, but obviously he gets cut uh, before the season starts in a little bit of a shocking move. Then you have, you know, Isaiah McDuffie, you know, a day three pick. There's just not much in this linebacker room. Oren Burks, of course, as well. But Devondre Campbell has really come into his own as a Packer so far. And it wouldn't be doing it justice without talking a little film. So we're going to go through some film primarily against the San Francisco 49ers and the Pittsburgh Steelers. We'll go through some plays from there, just showing you that he shows up in clutch moments. He makes big plays in a variety of areas on the field. So that's something we definitely want to highlight in this video. So, you know, if there's something you like and something you want to see more, drop it down in the comments, like the video, you know, subscribe if you're new. So with that said, let's talk Devondre Campbell here, get into some film, you know, obviously there's a lot of tackles, but you know, let's talk about why he's getting those tackles and why he's been such a factor. So let's get into this film here. So, okay, guys, so we're going to get into this film here. And really, you, we're looking here, Andre Campbell, first play. And what you're going to see is bunch concept at the bottom here. And really where Campbell is, he's going to get a hand on a guy running in this little mesh concept here. And he's going to, again, good recognition skills. He's going to wrap up George Kittle here in space, but nearly comes away with a pick. But again, good awareness in passing things off in zone coverage here. Again, this is a big third down third and short near midfield early in this game. And again, a big time fill by him. We're going to get another angle of this and you're going to see San Francisco's hurrying to the line. Everybody's shuffling around Campbell's here. And again, you're going to see him initially, you know, these guys obviously center, you know, left guard here working up to him, trying to get up to him, you're going to see him again. Realize Sermon's cutting back this way. He's going to work through the junk and with the help of his teammates, make a big stop there on third and short. But again, that vision, that processing is what we want to see. Now, again, defense, they're going to roll with this little motion here, pre-snap, but they're running this sweep here with Debo Samuel. Clean alleyway for Campbell to make a play. And does so. Good wrap up by Campbell there in space. Not too long later here. We're going to get play action here. Campbell's here. You're going to get play action. Off Sermon here. Some action. Two tight ends on the field. Really this play is covered. This is being sat on here. Good coverage by Alexander. But what you're going to get is. You know Garoppolo sees. Okay. Nothing here. I need to check down. Look at all the defenders in this area. I need to check down to Sermon. Well, Campbell reads that, knows that Sermon is his guy, and gets over there and makes a play, limits the yards after the catch. There was a lot of green over there. Sorry about the blurry on this one. Don't know why Game Pass was doing this, but here you're going to get double mug pressure here. Look for the Packers. They're bringing both these linebackers in the A gap. And what you're going to get here is Harris is now tasked with picking up Campbell on this quick design in the passing game. He needs to pick him up, doesn't really, and you see, not very clearly because of the blurriness, but you see Campbell getting a hand in the passing lane there, affecting the throw by Roethlisberger. All right, here, little motion you're going to get from Ebron, free snap, but you're going to see, again, Campbell's eyes, his keys, and where he fills against the run. This is a cutback run for Harris. There's a lot of green here. Again, Smith can close some of that gap, but you'd love to see a guy like Campbell work around this block, and he does. Look at that extension he creates. He's in a great position, kind of sets this sets us up where he has the lineman kind of over, you know, reaching here to the second level, oversetting to where he needs to be. He undercuts this. Obviously, Clark, great play as well, but they both there. 
Campbell included in that tackle to limit that run. Again, here you're going to see something similar passing game here for Campbell where he's, again, this is his guy here. Juju Smith-Schuster is going to run this little slant here. And Ben thinks, okay, I've got room here. There's some leverage that Juju hopefully is going to create inside. But, again, a good play. Yes, there's a wrap there, but gosh, a lot of guys do this. But, again, he makes the play. Big time stop there. We're going to get another look at this too. Again, he's still he's also running the show a little bit here, and that's something that I think you'll see more and more often is Devondre Campbell is kind of getting some guys set up, making sure he's communicating with guys of where, you know, where do I need to be, where do you need to be? And again, getting his hand in there to disrupt that throw. Lastly, here, this is honestly a great one here, just because again, it, it's the feel and, and really Again, recognition on what this play is going to be. This is fourth down. This is a big fourth down for Pittsburgh to try and get any momentum back. And they're going to run these crossers here in this sort of mesh look. So, again, gets his hands on Washington early. That's going to disrupt some timing here for Ben Roethlisberger. He'd like to see these two guys crossing already. Haven't done so yet. And, again, he's receiving this really well. This is great recognition not really sure why Ben is throwing this. Obviously, there's pressure here, but again, you might get Friermuth back here, or you take a whole shot look at Deontay. That's for another time. That's not what we're here to talk about, really. But you, you get a guy like Campbell who can, again, great recognition, nowhere close to that first down marker at all. And that's really something you see with Campbell's that recognition and really making plays in big spots. And you saw it here. So... Let's talk about that really and wrap this up a little bit here. Again, Devondre Campbell, what he does really well is he, he's grown in his role to be really a leader on this defense, especially the second level with this linebacking group. Again, not hard to do necessarily with guys like Summers and Burks, you know, rotating in here. But again, Campbell is making his presence known on this Packers defense in a big, big way. He's made key stops on third down. He, he's feeling well against the run. His processing his ability to get around blocks, he's making plays. And that's something he desperately needs to keep doing for this Packers defense to survive. And obviously, without Jair Alexander, it's, there's going to be some challenges going forward. Obviously, don't play the same position. But again, there someone needs to step up with Alexander out. And that guy can be Campbell. Obviously, they added Jalen Smith as well as I'm recording this. We're going to talk about him pretty soon as well on the channel, uh, maybe before the game on Sunday. But Again, Campbell can be a leader on this defense. Again, the recognition, his ability to fill, he's got good vision. I really like what I've seen. In space, he can make plays. Trust him to make a play in the alley for a tackle. We've seen all that on film here. So there's no reason Campbell can't, again, ele keep elevating his play and be a star in this defense where the Packers really need it. And they're going to need it down the stretch. they got a big stretch coming up against five really good opponents in a row. Having a guy like Campbell at the second level helps that a ton. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video on Devondre Campbell. If you did, maybe throw a like down there. Subscribe if you're new. We've hit 300 subscribers. That's awesome. Definitely want to get to 1,000, hopefully, before the year is out. Going to try and have a lot more film room videos for you guys. Obviously, weekly cheddar is every week. But, again, lots coming soon. Draft is obviously you know, starting to come around again. So we're going to be looking at that as well. So once again, guys, like, subscribe, tell people about the channel. Hope you enjoyed. See you in the next one. Farewell.